We are now joined by Molly Walker, who covers the Rangers for the New York Post. Molly, first off, thanks for joining us. I know it's great to get some time off as the team now doesn't play until uh, next Monday. Yeah, thanks so much for having me. I'm uh, looking forward to a little break myself. (laughs) So let's start off with something that basically everybody's talked about since it happened was the infamous Jacob Truba helmet toss. Uh, (laughs) Since then, the Rangers are 16-4-3 in their last 23 games, heading into that bye week and all-star break. How have you seen the locker room change or have you seen the locker room change at all since that incident? The locker room, definitely. It definitely took a little bit more time to unfold on the ice, I think, even though they did start winning very shortly after that. Um, they still weren't playing the way that they wanted to be playing. But the locker room, I mean, winning makes everything easier, obviously. So once they were able to stack a few wins together and in some convincing fashion, I think, um it was you know it just pumps new life into the room and gives everybody a belief that they are able to turn things around but on the ice I think it still took a a couple more games um to really start playing that straight line kind of hockey that they want to be playing um and it just became a lot more cohesive as everything unfolded I think and they minimized mistakes and and they started not hitting posts and and put actually putting it in the back of the net there um, after a very long streak of games where it just seemed like they were hitting five, six posts a night. So um, obviously seeing the puck go in helps as well. So I think it was all a bit of a perfect storm and and was able to, you know, spiral in the right direction um, this time around. So I know everybody outside the locker room will use that as a, as a, kind of inflection point on the season but have you heard anybody inside the locker room that could say yeah maybe that was uh, our spark 100% um I think that you know I think there's been a lot of conversation around Jacob Truba and his captaincy this season um but I think that that was a moment of emotion and I think even after that game the way that Jacob was talking about the room and what they needed to do and that they knew that something needed to change and fast um that the team followed suit and he exuded a lot of emotion that night, I remember, on and off the ice. Um, so I think that's what you need from your captain. I think that's, you know, a definitely a tell that naming Jacob Truba captain was the right move for the Rangers this season in order for them to take that next step. And, and they are back on track now. So I definitely think that a lot of the team points to that, that point as a turning point for them. <laughs> 